Hi everyone, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with a five box break of 2020-2021 Upper Deck Allure Hockey. Random team break number 10, one spot gets you two teams and all card chip. Big thanks to this group here for getting into this and making this happen. Let's double it up. And we combo the Ducks and the Coyotes in this one too to make 30 for each list. Let's roll it, randomize names and teams. One and a four, five times. One, two, three, four, and fifth and final time. A couple Courtney's down to a couple Troy's. One and a four, five times for the teams. One, two, three, four, and a one. Fifth and final time. After five, we got the New York Islanders down to the Sabres. And let me know if you want to make any trades. Courtney, Islanders and New Jersey Devils. Peter with the Stars. Walter with the Senators and the Predators. Troy with the Blackhawks. Stephen K with the Penguins. Walter, combo team. Uh, Ducks and Coyotes. Courtney with the Caps. Walter with the Canucks and Blues. Troy with the Wild. Courtney with the Knights. Uh, the Golden Knights. Peter with the Sharks. Troy with the Jets. Walter with the Bruins. Courtney with the Flyers. Troy with the Hurricanes. Courtney with the Red Wings. Troy with the Avs. Stephen K with the Flames. Walter with the Lightning. Troy with the Blue Jackets, Walter with the Canadians, Courtney with the Rangers, Walter with the Panthers, Courtney with my Kings, Walter with the Oilers, Troy with the Maple Leafs, and the Buffalo Sabres. Buffalo! Let's order these alphabetically. And we're going to pause the video in just a second. Remember, I marked all of those uh, 10 so we know they're all from the same inner case. Um, when we come back, we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around. Be right back. All right. Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. No deals were done here in this uh, Allure break on Thursday the 21st. Thanks, everyone, for getting into the action. Appreciate it. And good luck. Yeah, Rex, your Cubs aren't the only team that's done it. Dodgers did it last year. But then again, can can that same can the same thing happen two years in a row? That's a little more difficult. Dodgers squad is a little bit different from last season. James Van Riedsmick, Red Rainbow, and we've got a rookie double rainbow. Maxim Lutinov for the Sharks. That'll be for Peter. There's an Alexi Lafreniere for the Rangers. That'll be for Courtney. Another red rainbow here. All cards will ship, so you'll be getting all of these that you see here. Peyton Krebs. Watch out there, cards. Green Quartz, 33 out of 99. Die cut for Vegas. That'll also be for Courtney. There's Connor McDavid right here. And our autograph is Martin Kaup. Red Rainbow Rookie Auto for Troy and the Colorado Avalanche. Two ninety four out of two ninety nine. And there's an iced out Leon Dreisaitl. I kind of like that pattern there too. All right, next box. <laughs> Let's not talk about the passes. Carl's a Braves fan. He doesn't want to. Doesn't want to hear about the 
the ghosts of last year. I'm not, I'm not really worried about a coming back from a 3-1 deficit. I'm worried about let's win game, let's win a game. <laughs> next one after that we got Zach Paris 50 out of 99 Minnesota Wild green quartz die cut for Troy and we got an orange slice die cut Alexander Barkov for Florida that's gonna be for Walter There's a Ryan Getzlaff, Ducks Relic for the combo, Walter. There's your autograph, Nick Robertson for Toronto. Rookie Red Rainbow autograph for Troy and the Maple Leafs. And this is a different parallel here. That's a steel parallel. And I think that's... My food order coming here? Hang on a second. Stand by. All right, three boxes to go. The food was from Endangered Animals Food Company. I got some, uh, some scrambled condor eggs, some... Uh, some uh, endangered whale meat, gray whale meat, and uh, and some fried white rhino meat strips on the side. Mmm. All right, next box. That's right, Sheila. The more the more endangered, the the better. There's a double rainbow. Double rainbow. We like the the Kachucks, right? And the double rainbow is for Columbus. That's going to go to Troy. Vinny Malkin, and then we've got a double rainbow, Alexi Lafreniere. That's pretty cool. Nice, New York Rangers, Courtney. There's another one. 
And there's our autograph, Victor Soderstrom? Question mark, question mark. Oh, no, that's his number, 77. Looks like question marks for a second. That is for the Ducks-Coyotes combo for Walter. 292 out of 299. There's Igor Korshov, orange slice die cut for Toronto. That'll be for Troy. Ooh, and a walk for Albert Pools. And two more boxes to go. <laughs> yeah, I'm eating, I'm eating real life one of ones, exactly. All right, two more boxes to go in the Allure. And I'm going to take a uh, refuel the Big Hit Express a little bit. And when we come back, hopefully we'll be able to do uh, hopefully we'll be able to do some uh, transcendent. Would love to get that knocked out. Let's get some spots moving in those fillers, ladies and gentlemen. Scared money don't make money. I want to give away at least a few more spots tonight. And if we can do that, that'll get us pretty close to Breaksville on that Bowman Transcendent Baseball. Hockey actually does pretty well. I mean, my knowledge of hockey isn't very strong either, but it's a green court die cut popping here for the Islanders. Uh, Courtney with that one. But it does pretty, I mean, I know the big rookie names will do pretty well in the secondary market. Guys like, uh, I think Alexi Lafreniere should be pretty good. Connor McDavid, obviously. Orange Slice, Elvis Mers Lincolns. And especially the higher end stuff like the cup hockey, I know will definitely do pretty well. So like some of the top tier, handful of top tier rookies I'll kind of know, but not much about most everyone else. But from my understanding, it'll do pretty well in the secondary market. And I think with, uh, with the NHL getting a big TV deal again, there's Nick Robertson. You know, so now, now you're going to see hockey games on, I think they're all, almost a lot of them are on ESPN Plus, on, the, on big ESPN, big network ESPN, TNT has some games too. So I think with a with a little more of uh, of that should help um, you know bit by bit should help secondary market values for hockey even better, especially as it becomes a little more you know gets into more households on more TVs. There's Alex DeBrinket for Troy and the Chicago Blackhawks. Yeah, Gilo says Upper Deck makes great car too. Wish they can do more sports. Yeah, they're kind of a little bit of a smaller fish, so they can't be like fanatics and buy out licenses, you know, from the Players Association. So the speculation has been that fanatics will buy a company like Upper Deck and then arm them with, uh, with the power of the licensing and unlock more Jordan and LeBron autographs, which would be awesome. So... That could be that could be on the horizon, you know. So imagine, imagine. I mean, the lure is a pretty nice set. Imagine like a lure basketball. Imagine exquisite coming back for football and basketball, and that could be pretty huge. That's the speculation, anyway. I wouldn't say a bunch. I think I think Upper Deck canceled a few hockey releases just because of the. Uh, because of supply chain issues, but I think their their sort of top tier releases are still on the calendar and ready to go. All right, final box.
Good luck, everybody. It's Gabe Velarde, a youngster for the Kings, who I hope will uh, do well. There's a rookie double rainbow, Connor Ingram for Nashville. That'll be for Walter. Courtney with the Gay Velarde, red rainbow rookie. And we've got, oh, and a Connor McDavid, different parallel there, and a pink leopard, Anders Lee. I feel like I haven't, this must be short print. I feel like I haven't seen these too often. Uh, this is for Courtney and the New York Islanders. Yeah, that's the speculation, Gilo. Tops, too. Even Panini, maybe. Ooh, Chris Taylor? Nice, a two run shot for Chris Taylor. Ooh. Still alive. Dodgers still alive. At least for tonight. Let's finish off this game. Uh, the Connor McDavid goes to... Who's got Edmonton? Walter with the Oilers. Nice. Orange Slice. Morin, uh, Mor Morin? Morgan. Gecky. And Matisse uh, Kivlenkis. Oh, that, that's that's going to be a tough one for you. That's Matisse Kivlenix. Columbus Blue Jackets, Troy. Wait, wasn't this the... Yeah, this was the guy... Oh. Sad story. This was the guy that um, that got hit with an errant firework on the 4th of July earlier this year and passed away. So R.I.P. Matisse. This goes to uh, Troy and Columbus. Sad story. And that is that for Allure Hockey. Thanks for watching, everybody. I'm Joe. I'll see you next time for the next hockey break. Bye-bye.